boys and girls. Welcome to Miss Edder's Academic Corner. Yay! This is Judah Sr. and Judah Jr. Hey guys, nice to see you again. What book are we going to read today? We're going to do a reread. A reread? Yes. Sometimes you have to go back and read books that you've read before because things that you didn't understand, it'll help you understand it the next time you read it. Didn't you ever watch Barney get purple? Yeah, yes, yes, yes. And remember he kept repeating things over and over and over and over again? Yeah, but it helped me to learn. That's what we're doing. So that's why we've got to reread sometimes and that way it'll help you. So you guys take a, stay right there. And we're going to read a reread today. And it's called The Helpfuls. The Helpfuls. And it's written by Sheila Cook and Lauren Cook. Illustrated by Ibra Das. And remember, this is a softback book. The author, Sheila Cook, is the mom, and the daughter is Lauren Cook. And look at the pretty people. Isn't that pretty? The illustrator is the person that draws, and they draw the pictures in the book. The Helpful is a book that will teach children that teamwork will what? Make the dream work. So, The Helpfuls. Remember, you see four of them. One, two, three, four. Now let's find out what the helpfuls is about. And guess what? I happen to have gotten this book autographed. When you open the book, there actually is a picture of the mom and daughter. Sometimes it's nice to see who your authors are, right? So, it says here to Dr. Shannon Cook, who just recently became a bishop, you are my inspiration for putting action into my words. Thank you for being the gentle giant that helped me to get the job done. I love you, my king. Continued blessings, Sheila Cook. That's the wife, said that to her husband. Now, Lauren Cook says to dad, Daddy, thank you for teaching me how to be a leader. I dedicated this book to you. Love you, Lauren Cook. So a lot of times we have dedications inside the book. People say things they want to just thank people for. So let's get to the story about the helpfuls. In the garden of love are four best friends. Thoughtful, careful, boldful, and thankful. Known as the helpfuls. Thoughtful is the friend that always has the best idea to rescue those in need. So what we learned so far is that these four people who are known as the helpfuls also have the names thoughtful, careful, boldful, and thankful. Careful is the friend that makes sure everyone is always safe. Boldful is a friend that shows others how speaking up is good. Thankful is the friend who reminds others to always say please and thankful. See where they're at? They're like in a park and it's got trees. It looks like it's autumn. As the friends were all playing in the garden of love together, they saw the prettiest butterfly. Wow! The butterfly has so many pretty colors, said Careful, as they all looked at it fly around. And the butterfly is over here. So we see a lot of pretty colors. We saw orange, we see green, we see light green, we see yellow, we see pink, blue, red, brown, beige. A lot of pretty, pretty colors. Pretty colors make you feel good, too. When Careful saw it, he ran across the garden as fast as he could. He wanted to catch the beautiful butterfly so he could seek all the colors. Careful continued to run throughout the garden chasing the butterfly until it soon disappeared. 
this is careful right here. He's running around. Butterfly disappears. Oh no! Where did it go? Said careful as he looked around to see if it had landed somewhere close. Careful was no longer able to see the butterfly and he was sad. As he sat down against his favorite tree, Thoughtful asked, Are you okay, Careful? No, I'm not, Thoughtful. I was running through the garden to catch the beautiful butterfly so I can see his pretty colors. But then it got away, said Careful, sadly. So, Careful and Thoughtful. Thoughtful thought enough, the little girl's thoughtful. She thought enough to ask Careful what was wrong. And he said he was sad. That was nice of her. Now, Boldful came running fast. Careful, thoughtful. Come here. I found the beautiful butterfly. There he is, high in the tree of hope, said Boldful. How can we catch the beautiful butterfly, thoughtful? Asked Careful. It's high up in the tree. Maybe we can get Boldful and Thankful to help, says Thoughtful. I'm sure it will be easy peasy. Now, you might not be able to see it, but the butterfly is all the way up there in the tree. And all these colors go blend in, so it's kind of hard, but you'd have to look real good, and the butterfly is up there. So now everybody's trying to figure out, how do we get this butterfly? Thoughtful went to ask Thankful if she would help Careful catch the beautiful butterfly. I would love to help, said Thankful. So there's Thankful. That's Careful. No, that's not Careful. See how I mixed that up? That's Thoughtful. This is Thoughtful over here. That's the girl. Careful is the boy. Both boldful and careful ran to meet the girls by the tree of hope. Careful was excited. He may be able to catch the beautiful butterfly with the help of his friends. So we got two girls and two boys. The girls are sitting down. The boys come running. The healthfuls, which is all four of them, wondered how could they catch the beautiful butterfly? You got any thoughts, boys and girls? Careful, you are good at climbing trees. Maybe you can climb up and see if you can catch it, said Thankful. Careful came tumbling down to the ground as he tried to climb the tree. Be careful, said Bofel. Let me help you up. So Bofel helped up Careful. They thought about climbing that tree. That's not going to work. Bofu was very worried about his friend Careful. He wanted to help his friend catch the butterfly and knew that everyone needed to help. Careful asked, how can we get closer to catch him? Can you all help me climb the tree? Of course, they all shouted. Let's go. So, he Careful tried to climb the tree by himself. That didn't work. So now he's trying to get everyone to help him climb the tree. Do you think that's going to work? Bofel kneeled down and careful climbed on his soldiers, shoulders. Come on, said Bofel to Thoughtful. We don't want the butterfly to fly away. Thoughtful climbed the tree and onto careful shoulders as Thankful helped her. As she held out her hand, the butterfly, the beautiful butterfly caught on. See how they did it? One on top of each other. They worked together. We did it, Bofel shouted as they all smiled with excitement. Thank you, friends. I could not have done this without you, said Careful. They gathered together in a circle with the beautiful butterfly in the center and shouted, Teamwork makes the dream work. That's all of them four together and the butterfly is in the middle. Remember, teamwork makes the dream work. Now, 
that's the motto, or that's what you should have remembered from this book. If you remember nothing else, you should remember teamwork makes the dream work. And this book has some exercises. It says to you, what did you learn about careful? And then it says to you, what did you learn about thankful? What did you learn about thoughtful? And then what did you learn about boldful? It gives you some lines that you can write a few words of what you learned. Lauren's lesson, what she learned. Hello, boys and girls. I hope you remember that teamwork makes the dream work. Remember, boys and girls, teamwork makes the dream work. So whatever you need to do, sometimes it's best to ask for help. And together, you can get it done. Thank you.